Hi, I'm Jared George with the Red Power Team. In this video, I'm going to be covering how we adjust range on the TrueSight 2 row guidance system. So one of the reasons that we'd adjust gain is if we went out to our crop sensor and we measured and we know that we're two inches wider with our crop sensor than our row. And if that's not taken care of it, we're gonna come into the true site and we're gonna adjust the range. So what we'd notice is if you guys are running through the field and the, the combine seems like maybe it's swaying back and forth a little bit in between the rows, that's when we'd come in and adjust range. But before we do that, make sure and check your crop sensor uh, and refer to our video on how to adjust the crop sensor before we adjust this. So we're gonna take a look on the remote display and I'm gonna walk you through how to adjust range on the true sight. So from the main screen, we're gonna hit the red X one time and that's gonna take us into our main setup. So from this point, if I hit the check mark, that brings me into setup range. And you can see that our range is set to 40. So 40 is default. The way that we look at range or the way that we think about range is it's like an online aggressiveness. So if you think your system is a little bit too aggressive and it's hunting back and forth too quick, we would come in and we're gonna lower range. So default set at 40. And I'm gonna lower this because I feel like my system is a little bit too active right now. So I'm gonna hit the green check mark and that's gonna bring me in to where I'm able to adjust the range. So you can see that 40 is flashing now. I'm gonna take the dial and start rolling it to the left. And for this instance, I'm gonna take it down to 35 and then hit the check mark. And now you can see my range is set to 35. From this point, I'm gonna hit the red X and keep hitting it until it brings you back to the home screen on the true sight box. So after we've adjusted range from 40 down to 35, give the system a little bit of time to make the change. And if you need to make another change or take that down to 30, we go back in just how we walked through that and we'll make that adjustment and, and fine tune that machine. The same goes if the machine seems too lazy and it's hunting slowly back and forth between the rows, that's where we'd come in and we could adjust the range and increase that uh, you know, by five or 10 and, and start seeing how the system reacts. So this is how we adjust the range on the TrueSight 2 row guidance system. I hope that you found this video helpful. Uh, for more content covering our TrueSight operation or our combine operation, make sure and check out our redpowerteam.com or go to our YouTube channel and check out more videos. Thanks a lot and have a safe harvest.